Anthony Mason is a fairly new member with a big ambition, tackling music videos, comedy skits, and the variety. He's the producer of The Twin Cities Show. Now we caught you in our green room, or our makeup room. What, uh, what are you prepping in there? Uh, right now I'm, I'm prepping a character. It's a guy that's on a commercial called the Car Hop Commercial. I'm going to do a parody on that commercial called the Car Lot Commercial, and I'm going to be the Car Lot guy. And how is that going to go? It's going to go with me uh, offering finance plans and bull crap to people. <laughs> well, why don't we go into the, you're going to be shooting this in our studio. Why don't we go in there and you can explain just how you're going to do this. Yeah, okay, sure. Okay, now we're in our studio where you're going to be shooting your um, car. Yeah, car lot sketch. Car lot sketch. Yeah. And uh, now you are you going to use the green screen, is that it? Yeah, basically we're going to use the green screen here. Now tell us a little bit how, how you're going to do that. Well, last, we didn't get the lighting right last time we did a green screen, so this time we got to really focus on the lighting. We already have the graphics laid out for what's going to be behind us, and when we do post, when we're editing it, and we have the footage. We just need to get the footage of basically my head delivering dialogue so we can put it over the footage we already have existing on our project in Final Cut. Do you got bad credit? That was great. One more time. Turn your head slower this time. Okay. Okay, action. Do you got bad credit? I'm gonna have to redo that one again because the fucking jackass is upstairs. Let's do it. Okay, take five, action. Do you got bad credit? And that's right. Well, I'm doing. I'm gonna do a parody of a car commercial. So there's gonna be pictures of cars driving behind me. You know setting the perception to people that it's cool to get a car now and do what you can to steal from your mom so you can get a car and this and that and <laughs> you know boom 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 there's gonna be cars moving behind me with you know little subliminal lines of messaging like you know reader be buyer beware type stuff disclaimers rolling by and stuff now how much work do you put into how long is this sketch going to be first of all and how much work do you put into it the sketch itself is going to run about a minute when it's all said and done and the work that we put into it was scripting storyboarding, shot lists, preparation, makeup. Uh, I, I can't really say exactly, but it's, it's many hours. Now, why do you do this? I'm just trying to get experience, trying to get better at it. You hope maybe someday you can do this as a career thing? Yeah, maybe I can make commercials for people or something, you know, I don't know, get into summer somehow, other than making pizzas and delivering sandwiches. <laughs> Which gets us around to uh, how long have you been involved in this and what got you uh, in, in interested in video in the first place? Well, I just kind of kind of narcissistic, so I want my own show. No, no, wait a minute, you have to define that. You know, I'm, I'm not uh, that, that high par. What does that uh -huh. mean? So, kind of self-absorbed. Okay. Think of myself a lot, put myself on a podium. So I wanted my own show. I was thinking big. So I go about doing it and I'll, all of a sudden you see all these obstacles. It's kind of like creating a business plan. You figure out all the stuff that you need, and then you got to figure out how to get it. So it kind of just started there, and it started snowballing. And I found my dedication was greater than, than I thought it would be. Now, uh, is your interest primarily television, or your interest primarily the doing and the being on? Uh, the amen. technical or the... Uh, are you, do you rather be talent, or you rather be behind the camera? I'd rather have a mixture of both, mm -hmm. no doubt. I, I love to stir it up. I love to do graphic arts, video production. I'll hold the boom if I have to. I, I, I don't want to just hold the boom. That kind of sucks. <laughs> but, you know, I'll do it if I have to. You know, well, when did you become uh, involved or interested in video? Two years ago, August. So two years ago this month. Well, actually last month. So it hasn't been very long, really, that uh, it hasn't been a, a lifelong thing for you. You look like you're no. in your early 20s or something. Well, I'm late 20s. Late <laughs> I'm almost 30. But, uh, yeah, only about two years. But I did do acting before that. I had an acting coach, and I tried to get into a little bit of acting before that. So since '04, I would say really, really got started. Now, when is your show on? And tell us again, what is the uh, – is, is it a weekly show, and what uh, is the general content of it? The Twin City show, it's, it's supposed to be a half an hour long. It's, it's intended for late-night slots. There's – there's a lot of, there's swearing in it, not a lot, but there is swearing, there is some content, which is questionable, I guess you could say, dark controversial, comedy. dark comedy, very blue in nature, but uh, it does air on SPN and, and, and we are looking to get other memberships so we can air them in other 
public access sites as well. We're looking to saturate the metro area market and touch at least 100,000 households with our show by the, by the beginning of 09. Do you got bad credit? <laughs>